Sea pollution is one of the major environmental issues the planet is facing today, and most of it is caused, if not all, are traced to human activities. The biggest source of pollution in the ocean is directly from land-based sources such as oil, dirt, septic tanks, farms, ranches, motor vehicles, among larger sources. Thousands of tons of waste and trash are dumped into the ocean on a daily basis. The trash may also contain toxic chemicals which contaminate the oceans. Over 300 million tons of plastic is produced globally each year. Only about 10% of that is recycled. Of the plastic that's simply trashed, an estimated 7 million tons ends up in the sea each year. Animals who are most often the victims of plastic debris include turtles, dolphins, fish, sharks, crabs, and seabirds. In this documentary, we will be exploring the sea pollution in one of the beaches in Kota Kinabalu. Uh, frankly speaking, the plastic in the ocean is getting worse and a lot of uh, trunk rubbish to the sea is coming, not only coming from the houses but coming from the market from the rivers yeah, uh, where the water flows out to the sea. Plastic does not rot away once it has been produced. That means that all of the plastic that has ever been made is still in existence on our planet's surface. In the sea, it gradually breaks up into smaller and smaller pieces due to constant biting by the underwater species, but it doesn't completely disappear. Ocean currents cause huge areas of plastic rubbish to form in specific areas. It poses a significant health threat to the various sea creatures and to the entire marine ecosystem. Overall, plastic is the number one source of pollution in the ocean. Everyone on the planet has polluted the ocean one way or another. Factories that are in various industries make an enormous contribution to ocean pollution such as tires, water bottle, plastic bags, and many more. Littering causes pollution in the ocean which also causes a substantial loss of life beneath the seas. People get contaminated easily by eating contaminated seafood that can cause serious health problems, from cancer to damaging the immune system. Not only that, pollutants from the ocean seep into coastal freshwater making wells and groundwater contaminated. A lot of the plastic I think is driven up but in the night we if we go through the beach and there's plastic we pick it up and go to the nearest trash can. So there's trash can all the way. I can see uh, we went over here and went all the way down here and I didn't see one trash can so I think it could be great if it was. Even small amounts of these substances tend to have negative effects. The scale and the magnitude of the ocean dumping are not just vast, but are so huge that our entire civilization could be wiped out with the intensity of careless dumping. The discharge of contaminated water also causes the problem 
by way of ocean waste, and it tends to proliferate and transfer organisms that debilitate the growth of naturally occurring fishes in a particular oceanic area. We all rely on water. Without proper drinking water, we can get sick and transmit diseases easily. Life underwater will decrease. If this problem continues, the ocean will be even more polluted in the near future. We are responsible for what happens in the sea, especially being rational about throwing rubbish into the ocean. Prevention is better than cure.